So with Wi-Fi 6, we take that OFDM, the orthogonal frequency division multiplexing, and we add one more letter to it to make it amazing. We add an A, so now it's orthogonal frequency division multiple access. Let me add that A there. Now what's so special about this? Well, the headline, I'll go ahead and ruin it for you, <laughs> is that the AP can now talk to multiple, several devices at once, whereas before you could only talk to one device at once. Okay, big improvement, but it takes it even further, and this just makes me drool. I love it. Check it out. With OFDM, we divided our channel into subchannels, lanes on a highway. With OFDMA, we're still doing that, but we can divide it even further so we can make the lanes smaller. Now, what, what, what's the point of doing that? Why make the lanes smaller? Why ch have a little more bite-sized chunks? Because we can do this. Watch this. Let's get back to my example where my phone needs some Twitter stuff and my light bulb needs a color and my laptop needs to stream a video. Well, the access point can communicate with our devices, figure out how much bandwidth they need, how much of that channel they actually need, and reserve pieces. These are also referred to as resource units or RUs. So for a Twitter feed, we might just need a little bit of space right here. And that's how much we're reserving in that channel for the Twitter feed. And then maybe the uh, the light bulb only needs just a little chunk right here too. Just a little And then the laptop, he's streaming video. So he might be streaming a huge 4K video. So we'll, gi we'll give him some more stuff. We'll give him maybe three whole sub-channels. And that was actually two. I, mean, I, I can count, don't worry. <laughs> so once the AP has figured out how much of the channel to give each device based on their bandwidth needs, he can then send it all at once in one transmit opportunity. Now that is stinking efficient compared to how it was before where he's talking to one one device at a time and he's giving them the entire highway, the entire 20 megahertz channel, however big the channel is. Now he can divide up the channel based on their bandwidth needs and send it all at once. That is huge. 